G'day guys, welcome back to another Fallout 76 video. I'm on my main character today and I'll be showing you the camp that I just built just outside of Flatwoods. So it is literally underneath the River Gorge Bridge, just there. I built an apartment block and originally it was going to be one story more but I ran out of build budget so it would have literally just looked like a box with really no decorations at all in it. So this is what it looks like. I'll show you around the outside first. And also I used to actually have this in the Toxic Valley but decided to actually put it here because I thought it would look... Oh, bit of junk lying around. Uh, I actually thought it would look better here. So I've got the vending machines hidden at the back with the power. And I had to put a door in in the back because whenever I had people come to this camp they would literally open every single door, not close them and still not be able to find the vending machines. Okay, so now that we're inside this is like one of the main hallways and I just put like a community board up here and I'll show you each apartment is actually numbered and I have these really cute little Voltec welcome home mats. So this is the first unit. And they're all kind of like a studio sort of unit. Uh, so got some Helvetia and some lighthouse decorations in the display cabinet. And this is the living and the bedroom. I decided to use different flooring uh, to make it look like a rug. So we've got the kitchen and the dining room there. And we've just got a plain bathroom with not much in the way of decorations. I've literally maxed out the build budget again. I have a habit of doing that. <laughs> and this is the little deck area for this particular apartment. Also comes with a little topiary kitty. So that is apartment one done. Now I'll just walk down to the end here for apartment number two. And these apartments are all a little bit different, as you'll be able to tell from the decorations. So we've got some little trinket and a few hats in here and another kitchen with another dining room and we've got the bedroom there, got the lounge area here of course the bathrooms in here and again no decorations in here and this is the balcony has quite a nice view looking onto flatwoods and looking up towards the bridge. It's actually quite nice. Okay, so that is that one done. Now we'll head upstairs to the last two. So this is unit three. And I was given actually quite a lot of these magazines by some other um, players in the game that I actually uh, usually hang out with. So thank you to them for that. And also um, they gave me some of these little cute decorations here like that little toy alien. And I think the bumblebee. Actually no, I got that from Healthy Shop, I'm pretty sure. Um, so this is the other apartment and again another plain bathroom, nothing much in there. <laughs> and just out onto this balcony here, got some Helvetia Fashnut decorations with a nice little 
foresty looking overlook over the balcony. So that is that one and this is my favourite and this was not a deliberate decorating but most of the budget was used in here. Um, I tried to give each apartment a different story. So this is actually mine. I've claimed this apartment. <laughs> um, so it's heavily decorated. And except for the bathroom. Again, the bathroom is just plain. Uh, there is all of my bubble heads. And I put this weapon rack up and I didn't know which weapon to put up there. So I just got that security button and put the um, Adam Shop skin over it. I can't even remember what it's called. can't even remember for the life of me. Anyway, um, so here on this side of the display cabinet, we've got some more decorations. Um, so the clean items here, those two, the typewriter and the clock, was actually given to me by uh, one of my friends that play the game, so thank you for that. And this is the little bedroom area. And then we just pop out onto the balcony. Uh, so all of them, they're obviously avid gardener. There's an avid gardener, so um, they actually grow and pot a lot of plants and they give them to the neighbours. Which is why you see some of them have plants on their balconies. Well, actually, I think it's all of them. Um, <laughs> so that is that. And I was very frustrated building this one, but I'm actually happy with the way it turned out. And I can't wait to strip it all down and start again. So this is the build. I do hope that you enjoyed this one. If you did, please give it a like. Leave a comment down below and subscribe for more. Cheers, guys.